thunderstorms left a mark on Wisconsin with reports of flooding and damage from wind and rain. Today, towns like Janesville are left to clean up. Our Rock County reporter Adam Duxter shows us how neighborhoods are looking after the storm. I'm at Wright Road in Janesville where houses like the one behind me saw a lot of damage from last night's storm. Neighbors sat watching as a tree they say is more than 40 years old was pulled away. And what the storms brought down, crews will have to pick up. Uh, this tree right here, I mean, it's, you're talking a couple thousand pounds. For anybody that does like tree trimming and everything, it's not easily managed. In the morning, crews also work to clear storm drains. And with more rain in the forecast, people are working quickly. See, we got weather going on, rain coming in. We, we want to stop the damage before it gets internal. So far, the only area considered to be in flood conditions is Turtle Creek, and officials hope the storms during the rest of the week will not cause as much damage. I think at this point, people are getting ready and cleaning, cleaning up their houses, uh, getting rid of that debris and trying to put things back in order after the storm. But in the meantime, it's time to clean up. The good news is nobody was home when the tree collapsed on the house last night, and as far as we know right now, nobody was injured in last night's storm. In Janesville, Adam Duxter, WISC News 3.